Hello, people of YouTube. Hello, Silver Stackers. Hello, Coin Roll Hunters. Welcome to my little corner of the internet. This is Michael from Pennyhaven. And first off, if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button, then give it a like, then come back over here and hit that bell icon so you know when my new videos come out. All right, so today, another little mail call and another Star Wars item. So as you can see, i am got my big Star Wars smile on. I'm very excited about this piece. Now, uh, I first uh, was made aware of these um, from Lady Bullion's page. She did a, uh, a sponsored giveaway for this YouTuber, The Wolf 56 And I went and checked out uh, some of his videos of the pours he does. And I just had to have one of these pieces. You may recognize his logo, I will, of course, have all of his information in the description below. But uh, as you may have seen, recently I put up a video of my uh, Beskar Steel silver bar, two ounce silver bar that I got from a guy on Reddit. And now from the Wolf 56, I got this, which is just gorgeous. It's uh, brass and this figure here, this is a mythosaur. It's a significant sigil from uh, the Star Wars universe, specifically from the Mandalorians. Uh, Boba Fett had this uh, mythosaur sigil on his right pauldron, which is this little uh, shoulder piece of armor. It's called a pauldron. And basically the history of this is the Outer Rim planet of Mandalore. When it was first co uh, colonized, uh, which by the people who eventually became the Mandalorians, this mythosaur was just all over the, the planet and they hunted it to extinction because it was just a huge dangerous beast. Like uh, some, some history online says it was like as big as a small city, which is crazy. Uh, of course, this is all science fiction. I'm pretty sure though that in the Star Wars holiday special, they showed Boba Fett riding one and it was just like, you know, the size of a tauntaun or something, but according to the canonical <laughs> history, they were gargantuan. But this piece is just gorgeous. He does some amazing pours. Go and check out his videos. He's got a lot of cool stuff over there. And contact him. See if you can get in on this. He's got lots of different designs. Uh, he had three different ones for the Mythosaur, you know, this eight-star design, which I, I chose. There was a circular one and then one that was a little bit different. But he also does the larger aluminum Beskar bars that'll be, like, screen-accurate size. So that is really cool. I just had to come and show this off to you. I love, yeah, the brass. It's so wonderfully shiny. All right, so I've got two new big nerd pieces in my stack very happy with those i'm going on a bit of a buying hiatus now because uh yeah i got those two things like one day after another and i just gotten that uh ebay bag a week and a half ago maybe so i'm gonna chill out for a while but i still have some coin roll hunting videos that i'm gonna be doing in the near future so stay tuned for those uh, thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate your support I am now back to putting out videos more often and really, really enjoying it again. So thank you all so much for your ongoing support. May the force be with you and happy hunting.